Hey everybody, welcome back to Cars and Guitars. I got the hot rod sand sleigh here pretty much all done. I did the windshield frame last night and the uh, back of the seat there finished up. Uh, I got a, still gotta get a uh, seat for it. But uh, it's coming along now. I changed the front end, I put round headlights. The I dumped the square ones because I couldn't get them in once I got the dash, I made a dash for it. And once I got the dash in there, there was enough room uh, behind there to mount the original headlights. So I was going to go with some LEDs, uh, some square ones, but uh, I dumped the front nose. I had a little hood scoop that was going to go on there that I made. So it's over here. I dumped that. You can see the headlight buckets <laughs> where I uh, cut the rest off that I didn't need. Once I cut the, stuck them through there. And I ended up going with that and uh, the little grill here I made instead. So I just end up dumping the square headlights because I never did like them. And I'm going with some round LEDs. But it's coming along quite nice here. Uh, so that's it for uh, metal fabricating basically on this. I'm gonna start doing a bit of filler work. I put the original hood back in there. I just cut the top off it with the gauges, the windshield and uh, where the headlight went. And I just made some aluminum uh, pieces here and I made a little door that I can get to the oil and the uh, spark plugs if I need to. I'll just put a little latch on there. So I'm waiting uh, for uh, some vet bond to finish up the, uh, uh, the fiberglass on here and bonding that aluminum strip in that I made. And some of the uh, mounting holes on the side here for, I think there was a mirror or something there. And the side panels I have, I welded, I plastic welded them both together. They're two separate pieces. And I plastic welded them together and it's got a little bit of that uh, flexible two-part putty on there. I'll smooth those out and I'll paint everything in there red. It'll all blend in and got all the floor in, finished. So that's about it. Uh, oh, I got, uh, I made a back, uh, a uh, piece on here because uh, when I took it up for my test drive last time it threw mud all right up over top inside the sleigh so I had to build a little uh, mud flap thing here so <coughs> that will have to do for now plus I can pick the skidoo up and uh, uh, get the track off the ground and rest it up on that if I want to and uh, oh I put a little uh, I crunched in a little uh, license plate here where I'm going to put my uh, registration numbers in there. My little sticker. So, uh, so like I said, it's coming along. And I'm going to start doing some filler work now just to uh, get all around these uh, edges here where I did my welds and stuff all around the tail lights, smoothing it all out around the dash here and uh, around the front headlights where I um, cut the old ones out there. Bit of a butcher job there, as you can see. But I uh, used the uh, spool gun there, and it works just like a MIG welder, same sort of deal. So I just did uh, um, some uh, like tack welds beside each other uh, really fast and just joined it all up, ground it down. And I'll just do a little, like I said, a little bit of, I'll put Dynaglass on there first, all around my welds, and then uh, some filler work over top of that. So that's it for now. Thanks for watching Cars and Guitars. I'm John Bluen.